Spanish center back from Real Madrid and it is Nacho Why is see every time of flashback to do this like to do these scenes like to get old and then they get younger again Hi welcome to my channel today I completed 93 flashback Nacho Fernandez and it is 5 foot 11 mean high work rates 4 star schemes, 4 star weak foot, right footed and he can play center back, right back and also left back let's see his buy type, average or normal the play stars seems like he has all the play stars for defending and I'm gonna be interested about these 3 play star pluses which is block, intercept and then aerial and for the game itself for this card, Shadow is way to go to increase his space as much as possible and also his defending. If you are thinking to give him Anchor Kemisa, it is not the best choice because his control and also his pace will not look that good, but his physical will look even better. This is an advantage. And also you can make him lengthy because of the height. If he was 6 foot, you can make him lengthy, but on the height he is right now, you can make him. And as instructions, I'm gonna play with him on the default and let's see how good is this card from Real Madrid. Let's see how fits in game. Feels alright for center by 4 star camels. Okay. Let's see. Um, yeah, I tried to. Let's see. And yeah, that was a bad night tackle. Not a good start. But that was actually a good save from Allison. Thank you. Thank you for saving my mistake. Good interception. He used intercept playstyle. No block. No block there. But he did animation. Good stand tackle with his left foot. Good jockey. Good block by AI defending. Nice Nacho. Nacho again, he did a good stand tackle. Good interception, good interception. He is like a magnet when it comes to interception, guys. He just that um, if he was a bit taller, it'd be actually really helpful. Go slide tackle. Thank you so much, Nacho. Nice one. Good defending AI there. Ah. Uh, oh my God, Nacho. Even though he's not as strong on the pitch, he still put fights against play, which is nice, which is nice to see. Again, 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 great stand tackle on this card. Good long pass. Nice jockey again, Nacho. His defending is good, guys. If you know how to use and defend him manually, his, this card is going to be good for you. Good block. He come on the right time. Nice to see. Nice. Good offside trap. Good block again. Nice. He jumped himself there. <laughs> Nice again defending there. Oh, okay, that wasn't good. Good interception. Nacho, oh no, oh no. Vedna, let's go. We won in 3 games in a row with Nacho and Simside it is not a bad card. I played with him 3 games 
And now in game stats, his pace, he is fast in the game. His pass stats is decent, nothing crazy, but I tried long pass and also pink pass and were actually decent on him. About his DDB stats, well, here I could say that he's not clunky in the game, it's just that not a very jar in the game. The reaction, it is indeed there and also ball control, but don't expect to do the DDBs with him because his body type is not that good for him. And about his defending, I could say it is great. His defending stats, he has all the playstyles for defending, but what I like more on him, it is the jockey playstyle was actually good, the intercept playstyle, the block playstyle, the anticipate, and about his physical, well, I could tell you the area playstyle, it is not small, but you're not gonna find this card on corner kicks. And also his strength and aggression, it is indeed there, and he puts fights against Gyokeres, uh, which he has 99 strength, 99 grass, and also his seafood too, which is much taller than him, and he still puts him a pressure on him. So his physical, it is not a big issue. I think it is worth it. Well, I would say yes, if you need for him for the links, if you are a fan of Real Madrid, if you like small players, but but if you don't like this type of players, small players that are not that. Uh, length in the game, they are not that much stronger than other center backs in the game and also you want to score headers with your center back, maybe you should look for another one and as it is for this card, indeed he goes straight as S tier Is he better than Irine Paredes? No Is he better than Thiago Silva? When it comes to acceleration, indeed he is better than Thiago Silva but other stats, the defending, the physical, the reactions, the passing, the shooting as well, Thiago Silva has better than him in the game. And also, I'm gonna prefer these playstyles for small players. Is he better than Kunde? If you're thinking to be an upgrade over Kunde, no, it is not an upgrade over him. I'm just gonna prefer Kunde over him because. He has quick set playstyle, which is actually indeed, and also you can give him anchor chemistry to boost his physical, which is nice to see. But the thing that he has not over him, of course, is gonna be anticipate playstyle. Is he better than Bright? Well, when it comes to pace, indeed, he's faster than him, has better balance agility and ball control than him, but she has better shooting and also physical than him in the game. Is he better than Cordoba? With my experience, both are similar, they have the same playstyle plus, it's just that this card doesn't have blow playstyle plus. And which one should go? I think I'm gonna prefer Nacho over him because he's taller and also has better ball control than him in the game. Is he better than Lucas Hernandez? Well, yes guys, I indeed uh, Nacho is better than this Hernandez. I play with Hernandez and uh, yes indeed it is an aggressive card but Nacho he is a different card he feels better than him in the game like he put fights he put a lot of effort on defense and also he is better than Marquinhos I gonna prefer Nacho because he has 4 star weak foot and also has better G team balance in the game and also he has all the play styles for defending he is better than Sergio Ramos absolutely not thank you for watching and let's see what is going to do real madrid against borussia dortmund and look at Joselo guys he's hungry for an upgrade have a good day and see you next time